Good morning. Welcome to Sri Krishna Stories. Please, when I come to the temple tomorrow, the king angrily said that if you do not show the hair growing on the head of Lord Jagannath, your head will not be wrong. Simple story to explain. A devotee named Talisa Mohapatra lived in Puri. He was also one of the priests of Lord Jagannath, an expert who is well versed in the shastras. Throughout the day, Lord Jagannath personally served the idols of Baladevan and Subhadra Devi. These idols are everything to him. One day, the king came to Puri with his entourage. The king wanted to visit Lord Sri Jagannatha. It is customary to pay obeisance to King Bhagavan Sri Jagannath, who usually visit the temple. Mohapatra thought, if Jagannath's offering is not available to the king, he will incur the wrath of the king and took off the garland around his neck and put it on Lord Jagannath. The king came to the shrine and visited these idols. As usual, after the vision was over, the king asked the priest, Can I have a flower garland offering? He washed his hands and took the garland offering from the bishop and gave it to the king. The king received the offering with humility and devotion and returned to the palace. The wreath was neatly laid with white flowers with special scent. The king seated on the throne and stared at the flower garland. Noticed on of the long fetal hair stuck to it. It's so weird. How can this hair be in the evening? Jagannatha does not have a hair on his head. The king suspected that his Brahmin had taken off the garland around his neck, put it on Lord Jagannath and then said, This is Jagannath's offering. He ordered Mohapatra to be brought to the palace immediately. When Mohapatra was brought before the king, he knew that the king was very angry. I saw that he had a long hair in the evening dedicated to the Lord. When did the hair on the head of the Lord begin to grow? If we do not tell the truth, we will have to face death. King Mohapatra overcame his fears. He prayed, Bravo, please save me. I know what this king is I know that this king is severe. Who saw what kind of punishment he will inflict? It is better to escape punishment by telling a lie. So Mohapatra said to the king, Yes, it is true. For some time now the hair on Bhagavan's head has been growing. The king said, Priest, when I come to the temple tomorrow, Bhagavan said angrily that your ha- head would not be wrong if you did not show me the hair growing on Jagannatha's head. Talisa Mohabatra fell before Lord and said, Oh Prabhu, you are a sinner. I dare to chain the garland around my neck. Not wanting to be punished by the king, they are merciful. The king will take me away tonight and punish me severely. It is great that I drank poison and took my life before the king was captured. Lord Jagannath, holding a poison bottle by his side, with the decision to leave the poison life at the end of night, if he does not arrange to save himself. He went to sleep, expecting something miraculous to happen. Lord Jagannath knew the mind of the devotee. The Lord came to the room where Talisa Mohapatra was sleeping. The Lord appeared to him in dream and said, Why are you so afraid? You who have served me have nothing to fear. What can this king do to you as long as I am in this blue? You cannot be harmed even if crows of kings come. Why are you so afraid to look at this king? Am I bald? Didn't you see that I have hair on my head? Do not be afraid. Go to the temple tomorrow and you will see that I have a lot of hair on my head. You can show it to the king. Mohapatra looked up. No one nearby. Thought the dream. He wondered if the Lord had shown him mercy. In the early morning, the king came to the temple. He spoke to Mohapatra in an authoritative tone. Authoritative tone. Showing the hair on the head of Lord. Fearlessly, he said, What do you have to show? Go closer to the Lord yourself and see if you have hair. The king went behind the Lord and was stunned to see the long curly hair touching the waist of the sage. The king asked the priest, Did you glue this hair or the Lord's head? Or is it real that God himself grew it? He asked. You can test yourself to see if the hair is really fake. Mohapatra, when the king pulled some strands of hair from Jagannath's head, immediately blood started leaking from the Lord's head. 
When the king saw this, he fainted and fell to the ground. When the eye awoke, the king ran and grabbed Mohabatra's food. Please save me. I am a great fool and a great blasphemer to the Lord. So I was unaware of the mercy of the pious Lord Jagannath. Now I understand there is no difference between the Lord and the devotee. Fell at the feet of King Mohapatra. Jai Jagannath, Jai Jagannath, Jai Jagannath. Sarvam Shri Krishna Arpanam.